What's going on guys? Before that, our eyes Nigeria's color to my Nigerian people go know, you know what I'm saying? With love and strength and to da na na da da. What's going on, guys? You already know it's your boy M to the A to the C to the K A Y Vice, and I'm back again with another video. So this is gonna be the last time I'll be posting this type of videos on this main channel you know what i'm saying the next video like this is gonna be on the second channel so please if you haven't subscribed to the second channel yet i beg you go to the link in the description right now click on it and subscribe because we'll be vibing we'll be interacting we'll be you know what i'm saying you feel me so please subscribe thank you but i'm actually one of the happiest persons or shit persons or you know what i'm saying you get what i'm trying to say on the surface of the earth right now and you know why because Nigeria won their second game. In the AFCON. We won our second game in the AFCON. You know what I'm saying? Like Nigeria Sudan 3 1. You watched that game, didn't you? No, tell me you didn't watch it. Alright, so. Okay, we gave them 31 back. Do you know? Do you know the funny thing? Do you know the funny thing? We could have scored way more than three goals in that game. We could have easily we, we could have easily scored seven, eight goals. You know. But we just said, let's just get out of Shanu. Let's just have mercy upon them. Let's just have mercy on them. On last if one thirty one. And then about this like there are a couple of things I actually want to say about that match, right? There are a couple of things I want to say. First of all, the I don't agree with the the Sudan penalty. The penalty the the referee awarded to the Sudanese players, I don't agree with that because I just feel like it's too soft. Put it in the comment section, you know, if you think uh, they would award that type of penalty in the Premier League. Put it in the comment section. Let me know what you think because it, I think they wouldn't award that type of penalty in the Premier League. That's what I'm thinking. Cause it's just too soft and i feel like since the afcon started there have been so many errors and mistakes by our so-called referees why i don't know if you guys remember the game was it uh ghana no it wasn't ghana um there was a game where i've forgotten the, the people that played but anyways um it was the, the the referee stopped the game twice before the 90th minute what kind of stupidity is that who does that let me go try to see which game that that was why would you stop the game before be, you know twice before the 90th minute who does that i just feel like something has to be done about this referee man to be honest with you let me let me see um because i don't understand <sighs> mali have Beating Tunisia 1 0 in the controversial group of game at the African Cup of Nations African, that was ended prematurely twice by referee Janis Sikazwe, who later tried to play the final four minutes only for the North Africans to refuse. Like, why would he do that? That's what I'm trying to figure out. There have been so many blunders. And then I also watched the, uh, was he the Egypt Guinea game? Was it Egypt Guinea? Guinea? Yeah, Egypt Guinea game today. Did you see the goal the Guinean scored? I felt like they, they, they actually they, they, they cancelled that goal. Why would the referee cancel that goal? Because he claimed that the, uh, an Egypt player was fouled. Do you think that was a foul? <clears throat> no, no, please, Ebami Godada, do you think that was a foul? So there have been so many blunders, man. I just saw. You know, but my, my prediction is still we is 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 still the same, you know. Nigeria will come out victorious. I will have a big copy, right? Or what do you think? You know what I'm saying? Like I'm just so happy about the game, you know what I'm saying? We played very well. Of course we actually we 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 we, we uh, took control of everything. Like you see a Guav one that is really working or uh, that guy just completely changed the shape of the team. You know, it's changed the shape of the team. 
One second though. Really? So it was Samuel Chukweze that scored in the third minute. Uh, Taiwo Awoni scored in the 45th minute. And Moses Simon. You understand? Moses. I don't know if you know. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know the story of Moses in the Bible. What happened? Uh -huh. You get you. Uh -huh. So Moses against Egypt. Uh -huh. So this is our Moses. Moses Simon. Oh, she only she need 46 minutes. But the question is, how come we did not even score more goals after that? How come? So do you guys think we need to improve on our performance, or you think it's okay the way it is? Because the boys are already playing, they're already playing well. But what do you guys think? You think they need to actually improve the performance or what? <coughs> Let me know in the comment section. <coughs> but anyways, um, yeah, so we're looking forward to the the last game of the of the group you know for nigeria 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 and guinea guinea visa visa guinea visa 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 so we're looking forward to that game nigeria nigeria and uh guinea um nigeria guinea bissau so What's your prediction? Let me know in the comments. Put in the comment section, you know. Let's buy. Let's interact. I feel like Nigeria will win that game. Like, even though if whether we win or not, we're already qualified. We've qualified already. You know what I'm saying? But Nigeria, I'm up here top with none. We we'll use it to top it. And I, like I said, Nigeria will win. And let's see. My prediction is. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. My prediction. Is going to be. <sighs> Let's see. Three goals to zero. I might be wrong, but let's see. Three goals to zero is my prediction. We might score more, it might be less, but I know we're going to win that game and just end the group stage on a high, on a high, high, high note. But anyways, guys, that's just what I wanted to talk about today. I wanted to talk about the Nigeria-Egypt game. And uh, yeah, I'll be doing um, updates and analysis, reactions on subsequent matches. So please make sure you subscribe to the second channel. The next video will be posted on the second channel. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Nigeria, let's go win the AFCON. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know some other people, but right? some... All the African countries might be commenting or would comment in the comment section and say their own country will win. But let's find out. I believe my own country, Nigeria, will win. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. Let me know who you think will win the Afghan. And like I said, if you haven't subscribed to the second channel, subscribe right now because the next video will be posted on there. Thank you very much for love and support. I really, really appreciate the love and support. And um, I'll see you on the next one. Peace out. Arise, Peace. <laughs> oh.